What, what, what are we doing, JD? We're on the way to pick up a, a check. No regular check. <laughs> so we're on the way basically to pick up a wholesale check from a deal. That was close. That was like a nightmare deal, but uh, we were able to kind of get it closed. Um, there were some hurdles as far as uh, with title. Uh, dealing with not uh, inexperienced title companies. I don't know how to handle wholesale deals. It's horrible. Make sure you always find somebody who knows how to deal with wholesale deals when you're dealing with, um, when you're doing wholesale, like title, attorney. Make sure to have experience because this one's a problem. So we're about to go pick it up. Uh, if you follow this journey, uh, just go ahead and make sure you like and subscribe to this so you guys know what's going on. Um, and also, um, you'll see what's going on. We'll see you know, what the check is, what it's all about. Right, tell, tell them exactly what happened so you kind of fill them in because JD was more hands-on uh, over the back end. Yeah, so it was a deal that was picked up um, from one of our realtors, Carissa. Um, she wrote up this, uh, contract a month ago and they contacted us about two weeks ago uh, and countered so once they countered we we took up the offer and we found a cash buyer that was able to close they wanted to close it within three days but you know the title company wasn't ready to move that fast yeah um, talk about that title uh, never sent a hud so the title company basically we were teaching them how to work this, how to close an assignable contract. Um, we were sending them emails back and forth. I was about to get our attorney involved to help guide the way, but we didn't want to do that because the attorney was going to charge us a fee to, you know, help us close that, well, teach them how to close the deal. But, um, you know, being, having experienced people like Gene um, was really sending them emails, communicating this is, how it's supposed to look like. And that's basically how we were able to close as fast as uh, the buyer was trying to close. So it was just one of those things you just, uh, you wanna deal with an experienced title company or deal with a, an attorney, a real estate attorney. So, yeah. you know, we're about to take this ride to a title company It's about 15 minutes away. We're gonna go pick up the check. Uh, you guys get to see what we're doing. And that's essentially it. So if, you, if you're in wholesaling, you just gotta keep pushing, honestly. You never know when a deal's gonna land on your lap. You always gotta follow up. You always gotta stay in contact. Um, this was a good thing that actually took place with our, one of the agent reps that kind of did that. Crap, uh, I'm driving bad right now, it looks like. But okay, we gotta figure it out. Make sure you go the right way. But that's part of it. Follow up, if you follow up, Get to get deals and you got to be consistently on it sometimes you might think today's a bad day to work and it's not a bad day to work you got to keep doing what you're supposed to do so you might hear the rain in this video but it's because it just started raining beside the rain in Orlando. yeah where it's sunny and like two hours ago and now it's starting to rain Ooh. how great is that Let's go pick up this title. Let's go pick up this money. The title. So this was a big one, actually. Um, we we should have made more on this deal, but you know, we kind of did what we had to do to make sure it closed. Sometimes it's not about making all the money, it's about making some money. You can't always be greedy in this business. Sometimes it's about building relationships. So you don't always want to be too greedy where you don't make money uh, at all, and you don't build a relationship. Because remember, this business is based on relationships. And also, too, when you find deals, you can flip them yourself. Being that I'm, I'm able to flip homes, you just never know what relationship I might need um, six months to a year down the road. So make sure you pay attention to that. Uh, don't be so freaking greedy in this business. Yeah. You'll mess up relationships being too greedy. Another thing is um, even partnerships that we have when people, their ego gets too big, you know, people are not going to want to help you out because... You know what I mean? You're, you let your ego, you're leading with your ego. Yeah, so. Make sure we get some more sunlight and good quality for you guys. 
so it's part of it. We're let's let's get to this. Uh, yeah, we could do that. So we can just pick up the check. So I don't know if you guys can really see us in here. My seat fell off. Well, we just pick up the check from the title. We, I'll blur some of this stuff out. Um, damn, I can't show the title company's name, but whatever. I won't show them on there. But uh, oh, they're on here too. Crap. But we'll blur it out. We'll I, I'll blur it out in the video. So. Check, I'll blur it out. They won't see that, so I'll blur it out in the video. But um, this is it. Time to get back to the office. Now, this is just one deal. You ain't better work, make some other deals. Like, I don't get content about like one deal, which is good. We celebrate that, you celebrate your wins, but it's time to get back to work, work and do more deals. Like, I'm never content about just, like, we celebrate, now let's go to the next one. Like, that happened weeks ago. Let's go on to the next deal. Right. Now, one thing I can say is like one thing that um, E, Eric Thomas and his crew always says is winners win and losers lose. You have to get around people who have a habit of winning. You're hanging around people who have a habit of losing. That's the kind of results you're gonna get. So that's, that's not that's not bueno. I I, <laughs> I was smart enough to team up with people that already had wins under their belt. So it made the process and stuff like that easier because they had a trend of winning, which, you know, Gene and his partner Genesis. So build a team around people who have the the knack of winning, like the muscle of winning. You know what I mean? Important. Winners win, losers lose. That's it. This is it. We won't keep you guys long with this video. I am out. Sure.